Welcome back. And as you can see, we found us a little friend. One who we need. But he's not much of a pal. He's like one of the only Pokemon that haven't stayed in the Quick Ball in quite some time. Jeez, man. Like a day later. Giraffe rig. Spelled the same forwards or backwards. Though very small, the brain in its tail is still considered an important organ because it emits powerful psychic energy. Yeah, so he's like half and half, like cat dog on Nickelodeon. And in this game, he evolves into Farid Giraffe, which we fought at that awful gym that we almost couldn't be. Alrighty. Finally made it to the town where the water type gym leader is. You're not who we need. Would you change positions with this little dweeb who refuses to evolve? This is Porto Marinata. Our fame market is always bustling. Even at nighttime. I always get to new towns at nighttime. But I swear to you, I always play during the day. No, Palmo. Good grief. Some lovely houses we can't go into. Bursting with life around here, isn't it? I'll be the judge of that. The wind is salty, she says. Here's a tip. Close your mouth. Marinata comes from marinating, you know. When you soak food like meat or fish in lemon juice or vinegar sauce, mmm, it's delish. I don't know about vinegar sauce. The food here is really yummy. Everything's fresh and wriggly, kind of like me. That's disgusting. <laughs> I don't want my food wriggling. Come on up, stop on by. All our goods are fresher than fresh. Anything catch your eye? That was a nice little rhyme you did there. Oh, sweet, sweet Pokemon. If I could go around kicking you instead of talking to you, I would. Salty breeze is coming in over the sea. It's so nice. I wonder if still type Pokemon hate it, though. All that salt must do a number on them. I'm sure you're right, actually. That sounds like a still type Pokemon's hell. Whoa. Okay. It's so handy having a Pokemon you can ride. Feels like I ought to return the favor and let my Pokemon ride on my back instead sometimes, huh? Let me know how that works out. I want to try an auction. What? You sure? These big long metal box things here are what we call shipping containers. We pack them full of goods and things to sell. Then ship them off across the sea. Thanks for a beginner's tutorial in the obvious. To get to other regions, we go by boat. Our poor Pokemon can't carry us that far. Well, then they are weaklings. I swam to those rocks out in the water, and I'm pretty sure I spotted something on top of them. But I don't know how to get up there. I'm no pro at climbing cliffs or anything. Well... Allow me. Alright, we didn't disappoint. 
Gemi, gemi, gemi. So I was getting 50 coins each time we fainted a gimme go. Now I'm getting 60. I don't know if it's more with your level. With your, uh, you know, how many badges you have. Or what? Jump. Jump. Uh, good grief. Good grief, man. We didn't do too bad out here. We got some cool stuff. Ooh, some treasure. Things we can sell for moolah. And that too. Money, money, baby. Bottle cap. We're gonna need that, believe it or not. Sounds like a piece of trash, but it's something we'll need. Okie dokie then. Can I fly back? Probably not. We didn't even visit. Yeah, we did. Yeah, we did. Actually, you know what? While we're here, I'll go on and sell my treasure. Actually, while we're over here, we're going to hit this lighthouse. Ooh, I guess there's always an item behind the lighthouse, too. Man, what's with all these jacked women? Did you cross the Sado Desert to get here as well? You didn't happen to see a kind of weird Pokemon on the way here, did you? You must be talking about the Titan. Phew, I think I'll definitely be using the flying taxi to get back to Cascarafa. Same. Oh, he has a blue whooper. Wow, the market looks so tiny from up above. It kind of does. Hyper beam. There's islands bubbling up out of the ocean. Wow, so high. Mm. Now, don't you run around up here. Okay. I scream, you scream. Even if you sing that, I'm not buying you any. That actually wasn't bad. When night falls upon the city, ghostly Pokemon appear up above. Why do you think they come? They come to feast on your dreams. And I'm not making that up. Next stop, the kitchen. Come, Pomo. That's the sea. What's the sea? Oh, okay. This isn't a dock. This is a connector to the beach.
Oof, this is heavy. Because you bought too much. Ha! Women. Look at you, little Mr. Student. Here to try your hand at the auction. Careful you don't drive the price up too high, or you'll be crying into your empty pockets. Oh, wow. Little pictures. Of water type Pokemon. Oh, and they're all different so far. People say that a long time ago, before I was even born, there are always fights breaking out here. Not anymore. Now we got lots of tourists. And even kids can walk around and feel safe. There's a battle court right here in the market. Nobody's allowed to get into fights here. You've got to work something out. You do it through a friendly Pokemon battle. I think we will. Oh, and here's our guy. Mr. Clean, Mr. Clean. Vault and Velusa, where, where in the world? It's my wallet. Those were his eyebrows. <laughs> Without my wallet, I won't be able to get today's hot item. I'll get bought up. It'll get bought up by someone else. Sniffle. Don't worry, old man Kofu. I'll run and look for it right now. Yeah, run across the desert, why don't you? You're not getting credit for finding the wallet. What do you want? Old man Kofu's in the middle of some super duper important ingredient buying. If you're thinking about trying to interrupt him, then I, his best apprentice, will have to stop you. So do you have something super important to say to us busy folks or what? It's important. Super important, eh? We'll see about that. Maybe a battle will shut your mouth. Well, no wonder people got into fights here, man. Look at this disrespectful Ryan Seacrest looking choke. Tell you what's what. Oh, whoa, whoa. Shucks, I let old man Kofi down. Just get out of my way. Before I lose my temper. Dang it, that backfired. Now my wallet's empty too. Hey, you step right up and tell me what's all the ruckus about over here. Uh, old man Kofi, seems this kid's got something to say to you. What's that now? A customer here for a little old walletless, moneyless me? What can I do for you? Vault and Velusa, my wallet. Say what now? My lobby staffer sent you out here to bring it to me? Da ha ha, that's a huge help. Thanks for coming all this way. Guess I should apologize for my little apprentice too. Hope he didn't bother you too much. There's something here at the Port Marandata auction that we really want to get our hands on. So as you can imagine, we were both a bit worked up to find I'd forgotten my wallet. Ladies and gents, you won't want to miss this. Here comes today's last item. Hmm. <clears throat> Feast rise on the main event. I have here the legendary Wacom Seaweed of the Hoenn region. Do I have any takers? Vault Belusa. I don't even have to touch it. I can see it's got the springy texture of seaweed. Chock full of nutrients. And just look at it, how it catches the light and shines so brilliantly. I mean, he's, there are exclamations with everything he says, so that's why I'm so uh, energetic. Oh, and that rich, fresh aroma of something plucked straight out of the ocean. I need to get me some of that. Now listen, kid. If you want to challenge me at the Kaskarafa gym, you're going to need some smarts. And this is a perfect place to test you. Get the winning bid on that seaweed for this seaweed for this old man. 
Okay, but your money, not mine. Ha ha you already know the ins and outs of auctions at such a young age. You're something else, kid. Here you are, fighting funds for the auction. Be smart with it. And win this old man that seaweed. 50k. Gosh, man, so choppy, that NPC. Hoenn's legendary Wacom Seaweed. We'll start the bid at 10k. Don't bid. Well, that was quick. And we have 25k. We're at 25k, do I hear more? Uh, we'll do 30. What a big spender. 40. And we have 40k. We're at 40k. Do I hear more? 45. Do I hear more? We're currently at 45. What in the world? Sold. Sold for 45,000 to the little gentleman over there. Yep, you lost. But we spent like all his money. That was amazing. You put those grown up bidders to shame with your bidding skills. Thank you for winning that seaweed for this old man. I'll be taking it now if you don't mind. Would've been cool if we'd keep that. This seaweed's a great catch. I'll be feeling low as the seabed if I fail to get my hands on it. If there's any of that money I gave you left, feel free to keep it as a tip. You can even use it to try your hand at the auction again if you like. Alrighty, I'm gonna head on back to the Kaskarafa gym now. Old man Kofu's gonna prepare a real good battle for you. See you there. Cool apron. Yeah, so our auctions a real thing. Like, can I do that on my own now? Cause that would be cool. Welcome to Sure Cans. Our can-do attitude is sure to leave you smiling. Oh. These are just miniature versions of the same crap we always see, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Hola amigo, we've got 54 tomato berries up for auction. Bidding starts at 3,900. No. Rotom catalog, get it while you can. What does that mean? Rotom catalog. And it's just a sparkly nothing? I don't even know what it is. Five hundred. Thousand. Fifteen hundred. 2,000, 35, 4,000, oh man, 5,000, 5, for real, what in the world, sold a young student, very well done, I have no idea what I even just bought, thank you for your generous bid young man, that'll be 5,000 if you please, our stock is always of the highest quality, do come and bid again won't you? So the gym leader basically just bought that for us. But what did I just buy? Rotom Catalog, a catalog of devices that Rotom like. Use the catalog to have Rotom hop in and out of the various devices listed within. Oh, okay. So I can change. I have Rotom. I can now change it to whatever I want. That's cool. Okay. That was worth it, probably. I don't know. Horse radishes. Ultra balls, you want them? We got them. That might be a deal, I don't know. 30 ultra balls. We'll try for the ultra balls. Always need those. Haul in their wheel, kids. 
I'm starting off bids for this lot at 8,400. Let the auction begin. 89, 94. 10, 4. 10, 4. Yeesh, that's too much. Well, that was a great deal. This lot is yours for the keep, and that'll be 12,400. Please and thanks. We just saved some money, money. Wish they would like. What do you mean, horse? Ra I guess that's an ingredient for sandwiches. Is that a rare item? I sure don't know. Oh, okay, and you're just a stupid vendor. And you're just a stupid vendor. Oh my goodness. Okay. Well, away we go. Here we go. Oh, Lolly's Namona. Not Nicole. It's finally time for your last gym, right? No, this is. Is this the last gym? I heard from Rika, but I'm 0% worried about you. I know you got this. Even La Primera seems like she wants to keep an eye on you. Maybe I'll go find her so we can cheer you on together when you battle the gym leader. So go have a battle that's fruitful for you and for the crowd. She always says fruitful. She's like wearing it out. You can never tell what's troubling someone just by looking at them, you know. In Psyduck's case though, I think it's safe to say that headaches are the problem. Oh yeah, 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 okay. Yes, you're cute. Go, gorge and greet him. Old Man Kofu, incredible, he's always so cool. Kofu's gym test was an ultra ball level challenge, let me tell you. No idea what you're talking about. We didn't have to do that. But Nickel, I heard you reunited Kofu with his wallet. I can't thank you enough, though this is a little regular. Please consider your gym test passed. Are you ready to challenge gym leader Kofu? The Surgeon Chef. Very well, allow me to show you to the battle court. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we got this in the bag. The Pokemon surrounding this town were very low level. I feel like we should have been here a long time ago, but we weren't. Oh well. It is what it is. Old Man Kofu, play with us, come on. I would be honored if you would try a new item from my restaurant's menu as well. Sorry everybody, I've got some business to take care of as gym leader real quick like. I'm keeping someone waiting you see, please forgive me, I need to do this first. Okay. Yeah, get out of the way. Hey, you step right up. I've been waiting for you. Thanks for the help over in Puro Marandata. You did a mighty fine job. Now that I've got this legendary seaweed, I can make some real quality dishes with it. Don't expect me to go easy on you in our battle here. At the auction, we battle with buying and selling at my gym. We battle in a more traditional sense. Moves and tactics, ever changing as the raging sea. I'm gonna serve you a full course of water type Pokemon. Don't try to eat them though. Heh heh heh. Like poor tentacle. Of course. A Vault and Velusa. I feel a bit indebted to you, but don't expect me to go easy on you just because of that. Okay, level 29. We've got this in the bag. I wanted to feel a little nervous about this because it was the last gym, but... No need. No need. 
bug trio. Oh my gosh. I just lost all respect for you as a gym leader. Look at this wet fart of a Pokemon. Crabominable. The tides ebb and flow. It's time for a raging tidal surge. I wasn't looking. Was this the last one? Oh, that's his last one. Okay. Um, tell you what. We'll give our ball of a... It's time in the sun. Prepare the rigging for a big transformation. My Pokemon gonna rock the boat. Ah, 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 ah. One old man Kofi special coming right up. Hang on tight or get swept away by the surgeon and something. I don't think we've seen our ball of uh, trash device, have we? It's high time, I say. Beautiful as ever. Bam! Bam! Never mess with my pretty wreath again. Walton Galusa, you're a lively one, aren't you? A little too lively, if I do say so myself. Yeah, that wasn't bad at all. Ga ha ha ha! The loss is refreshing as the air at the morning market. I'm just like a helpless little Magikarp to you, eh? Flopping around all willy nilly. You got me good, I tell you. What a great catch you are. Just like a master fisher, you held on tight till the last second and reeled in victory. Now it's time to hand over a gym badge to you. And let's get a real good photo together using a pose I've been waiting to try out for a while now. What's that gonna be? <laughs> okay, that's actually the best one yet. That's pretty good. It would have been better if we were standing over the edge of a cliff of one of these elevators, like facing the other way, over the desert or something. With eight gym badges in your possession, you can catch Pokemon of any level, and they'll all listen to you when you ask them to do things too. Let me throw this in too as an extra special bonus. I'm sure you can make good use of it. Chilling water. Wonderful. Alright, it's about time I headed on back to my restaurant and got to prepping for the next wave. You come back to see me again now, you hear? I think I will. Are you actually going to be at the restaurant? Because I'm actually a professional food critic. No, Nickel. Almo, you did it. Oh, I'm so happy for you. This is the best. I know I said I wasn't worried, but my heart was still pounding the whole time. Most impressive, no nickel. A shining display of talent, I must admit. Seriously, pat yourself on the back. You beat every single gym. Which means, indeed. Now that you've gathered eight gym badges, all that's left is to take on the Pokemon League. If you hope to stand alongside Nimona as a fellow champion, head to the Pokemon League. That is where you can take on the champion assessment. Oh boy. That's from Mesa Gosa, if I remember correctly. Yeah, hurry up and get to my rank. I'm itching for a battle of equals. 
You've got to take the time while you're facing the Pokemon League to fine tune my Pokemon's moves and revamp all my tactics. Very well, good luck, now, Nickel, and wish me luck too. It's unusual for me to see her so excited, though perhaps not for you. She must really be happy that she finally has a friend who can keep pace with her own talents. There's a special kind of strength that can only be reached by competing with a good rival. Count me among those eager to see how far you two can go. In any case, I'll be waiting for you at the Pokemon League, northwest of Mesa Gosa. I was right. Oh boy! Holy crap, it's just hit me that we might be nearing kinda sorta the end of the game. Anywho, come back tomorrow for more. Bye y'all.